So next, uh, we are going to go into, we have some questions about uh, how to add uh, blind spots on Ninja Trader and Sierra chart. So we're going to cover that. Uh, so the first step, if you are a premium user, you can now access our Ninja Trader and Sierra chart indicator within your account dashboard. Every morning, you can download the key levels file here. It will be updated, updated once a day. So you can plot that into the indicator, and it will plot the levels. Uh, right now, uh, the, the file, and I'm going to show you the Ninja Trader file, uh, it comes in this format. Just all right. One second, guys. Sorry. All right. So this is our Sierra chart file, right? Hope you guys can see. So as you can see, it doesn't have the blind spots. Uh, so in order to add the blind spots, uh, we need to kind of uh, do a couple of simple steps. So first, you, we can modify this text file. So we can go in our in our bot, and we can go in our um, on our chat room. And for example, let's say we wanna add the NQ1, which currently is a September future contract, to our file. So I can simply copy the levels here, and then go back to our Sierra chart indicator. One second, sorry guys. All right. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do control F and we're gonna do uh, NQ, right? And then we're gonna look for the 09 contract, September contract, right? So we have it here. Uh, and then what we what we simply do, this is goes with the Ninja Trader and Sierra chart, we simply add comma and again okay so simply add a comma and just paste our blind spot level then save the file and then simply re-upload it into the platform uh, if you have different uh, data sources in Sierra chart just make sure you select the right source that you have and just like add the Add the blind spots there and just save it and then upload it uh, very soon we're going to have this file automatically uploaded but for now this kind of like is a step that you would need to take to add the blind spots to that platform okay 